I want to say that despite the administration's arguments that are laid out that you all are all guns blaring and green lights for drilling, the facts that I checked, and if you disagree, tell me, only 21 permits for offshore drilling have been issued by this date. In 2010, there were 32 permits. I just left the annual conference of LOGO, which is Louisiana Oil and Gas Association, Mr. Secretary, yesterday. They are beside themselves with not being able to get their permits processed. And to answer you, Mr. Franken, let me just say that Exxon and Shell may be making record profits, but according to a study recently done by the Greater New Orleans Inc., 41% of our oil and gas independent operators and service companies, I'm not talking about Exxon and Shell that have operations all over the world. I'm talking about companies in the Gulf Coast, in Texas, Mississippi, Louisiana, and Alabama. Let me tell you what the, the studies show about their profits. 41% of them are not making a profit at all. 70% have lost significant cash reserves. 46 have moved operations away from the Gulf, and 82% of business owners have lost personal savings as a result of this slowdown. Now, part of it is the accident, and part of it is the 